Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's video, I'm going to show you guys how to resolve print spooler issues or print queue errors in which you're trying to print something and it seems like it's taking forever to load or it's not ever going to print. This tutorial will be for you guys. So without further ado, let's jump right into it. And we're going to start by opening up the start menu. And you want to type in printers. Best match should say printers and scanners. I want to open that up. Now underneath printers and scanners, you want to select your printer on here, and then select open queue. You want to select the printer tab at the top right here, top left, and then select cancel all documents. It's going to ask, are you sure you want to cancel all documents? Select yes. Once you're done doing that, you can close out of both of these windows. Now you want to head over to the start menu and type in command prompt. Best match should say command prompt directly above desktop app. You want to right click on it and then left click on run as administrator. When you receive a user account control window you want to select yes. Now into this elevated command line window you want to type in NET space stop space spooler so net stop spooler so NET space stop spooler two O's in spooler then you want to hit enter on your keyboard once it says that it has been stopped successfully, I'm going to have a command in the description of the video I want you to paste into the command line window. So to paste it in, all you have to do is just right click on the top bar here, left click on edit, and then paste once you've copied it onto the clipboard from the description of this video. Then you want to hit enter. Once you're done running that, you want to close out of here. Open the start menu back up. Type in device manager. Best match should say device manager right above control panel. You want to left click on that. You want to open up the start menu. Type in services. Best match should say services directly above desktop app. You want to left click on that one time. And now you want to go down and to get to print spooler right here. And you want to right click on it. Left click on properties. You want to make sure startup type is set to automatic. And then you want to click on the start button right here. Once that's done, you can click on OK. And at this point, I recommend closing out of any open programs or windows you still have open on your computer. Restart your computer as well as restarting your printer. So turn it on and turn it off again. And hopefully your issue has been resolved. So as always, thank you guys for watching this brief video. I do hope I was able to help you out. And I will catch you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.